Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you my recipe for making American pancakes. One of the easiest recipes that you have to try if you didn't try it before. So let's get started. I'm gonna start up with some milk, or the ingredients are gonna be right down in the description below. I'm gonna add some vinegar to it, and then I'm gonna set it aside until the milk start to thicken a little bit. And then I'm gonna add this milk to three egg yolks. As you can, th can see, I'm gonna add the milk to it. And then I'm gonna add three tablespoons of melted, uh, unsalted and melted butter to it. And then I'm gonna add some vanilla. You should add a good amount of vanilla so you don't end it up with an egg flavor. And then I'm gonna add my dry ingredients, which is all-purpose all flour, a pinch of salt, and baking powder, and baking soda. I'm gonna mix everything using my whisk. Uh, I don't want clump any clumps in my batter, so mix well until everything is nice and combined. Now I'm, I'm gonna grab my egg white, and then I'm gonna add uh, some vinegar to it, and then I'm gonna start to whip it using my electric mixer which is way easier and then i'm gonna uh, i'm gonna add my sugar gradually when i start to see those foam or when i reach like the foamy point i'm gonna start to add my sugar gradually uh, here i have like three tablespoons of sugar i'm gonna add it gradually until the mixture reaches like the soft peaks point this this is the point where you want to stop. I'm gonna t take a spoonful of the egg whites and then I'm gonna mix it with this with the mixture. So I want to lighten this mixture. And then I'm gonna add the rest of the egg white. And then I'm gonna fold it very gently as you can see. You don't want it to get out the air that you combined with the egg white. So please be super gentle. This is the texture and the thickness that you want your pancake batter to be and now i'm gonna start to cook my pancakes over um, my non-stick pan um, over also over a low heat and then i'm gonna let it cook until i start to see like um, some bubbles creating on my pancake uh, at this point i will flip it when you flip it, uh, when you use like a good nice thick pan and you don't add any butter to the pan, you ended up with nice golden color in your pancakes and this is what you actually want. But if you don't use like a good quality of pan, you just can add some butter. And now I'm gonna start to serve it. I put some blueberries and strawberries over uh, around my pancakes. You can also add banana, you can also add any like fruit that you like. And then I'm gonna add a cube of butter and then I drizzle the honey over my pancakes. You can put honey, you can put maple syrup, you can put Nutella. What do you actually want to add? Like you can go ahead and add it. You guys, it was super, super, super fluffy. It was super delicious. It's like the perfect choice for your breakfast. And you don't even like you, you don't even need a knife to cut in your pancakes. They are super super soft and like they are amazing, you guys. As you can see, they are super fluffy also. Now I'm going to show you another way to serve your panca pancakes, which is the one that I prefer. I spread some peanut butter over my pancake, and then I put some I put some blueberries are over my pancake, and then I put some honey. You can put some maple syrup if you want. And yeah, enjoy it. It's amazing, you guys. And you have to try this recipe. It's amazing. And that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. And bye.